you go. We're both there. Hey. Yay. So today we are at Smokehouse Barbecue. Yeah. The new Smokehouse Barbecue. In Oakwood, Georgia. It's been around for a while. Smokehouse was established in uh, 1978, I believe. Yeah. And they recently tore down the building that the restaurant was originally located in, and they renovated an old Kentucky Fried Chicken that was next door that had been closed down for a long time, and that is their new location. The old location was behind this. Like right over there. It's now gone. I have pictures. I'll post those in the video when we do the editing later. But today we decided to finally stop in and try out the new menu. Um, we're just doing sandwiches because it's kind of a quick thing that we thought to do. Late lunch. Late lunch, early supper, in between lunch and supper because we've already had both. Or no, we've already had lunch and we're going to have supper. But anyway, we really wanted to try, so we're here to try. Okay. They have a bunch of different kinds of beets on their menu. They have chicken, pork. They have drinks. Drinks. They have beef. They have chili. They have ribs, I believe. And, uh, they have ribs. Probably brisket. I need to put they have, You can order ribs sandwich, or you can order ribs by the rack. You can order half rack or whole rack, which is pretty good. They have good friends with stew, and they offer a variety of sauces. You got the original. I got the original because I'm not into hot stuff. I figure I'm spicy enough already. It's a slightly brown color. And I went with the Sweet Heat, which is like the original but with a hint of jalapeno. And it's a little bit more red. They also have Alabama White. And I think they have South Carolina Barbecue. All the different kinds. Alabama White seems just a little bit racist. But Anyway, and you went with? I went with the beef. And I went with traditional southern pork. Because I'm not from the south. Big damn Yankee. I'm a damn Yankee. Oh, and they always put the sauce on the side so you can add how much ever you want. Or you can do like I do and treat it like a Reuben and just dip. And it comes on either a regular bun or a garlic chip bread. And it comes with a mandatory pickle. Pickle. Eat. Best to have a pickle. Let's see. Pork. Pork. And beef. Beef. It's heavier. With a mandatory pickle. Yep. I've actually got uh, like three or four pickles on top of mine, which is awesome. I have one. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Mm. That's good. Now, and I'm going to take the pickle and I'm going to put it inside because I'm a Yankee. I put it inside too. Because she's not a Yankee. But I put my sauce on first. See, I'm basically a purist, so unless the sandwich really, really cries for it, I don't use the sauce. Um, in future, I'll probably tell them I only need one because they are very generous with it. They give you two, but there's a very good chance I won't need either of them. I think we're backwards. <coughs> yeah, I got pork. Oh. It was good. I put a little bit of mine in there. Can I taste that? But then again, mine was a little bit tough. That's big. Big? I messed your tongue. You want some more? Um. What do you want me to? I'm going to try her sauce. It's really not that bad. I say that to everything. Do you mind if I took a bite out of it? <laughs> I don't care. Okay, we're going to switch back. Okay. And you get the one and a half. Now I get one and a half. She gets five pickles. Ooh, you want one? Okay. So, so my sandwich. There's that skin. Now we're going to turn it around. And that's meat. With sauce all over it. And this is pork. Okay, 
actually, as I said, I don't generally put sauce on it, but this is really good. Yeah. And this is the sweet... Sweet heat. Sweet heat. Which isn't really spicy hot, but it has a good seed. Yeah. Really juicy. Without the sauce. And it falls apart in your mouth. is very close to here. I can see where I probably drop by here about once a week and work my way through their menu. Yep. Work, work your way through their menu. positive is actually made in the house. I like that a lot. Let me see if it's like I remember. A little bit of spice. Okay. It's not a little bit as, of pepper. It's not as tomatoey. It's more like a Brownish tomato ish. I like it. It's a it's good, good. dip in sauce. It's a good. Mm. Oh. oh, hell yeah. You put the two together, that is. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You don't need sauce with it, but it adds so much kick to it. Something else I want to point out. The staff was extremely friendly, very nice, very courteous. The entire restaurant is spick and span top to bottom. Yes. The bathrooms, amazingly clean. There's lots of big windows and you can see out and you can see out and watch cars go by. Everybody is friendly. They let us walk around taking pictures inside. Um, it was really just a really, really nice experience. I'm glad Smokehouse is still in business even though they're a couple hundred feet away from their original location and i'm glad that they're doing good business so far and hope that they continue to have much success this is the perfect barbecue sandwich to pick up on your way to a football game football local game. high school in the fall heading out to the lake whatever you need go get it it's no good stuff To finish up eating. I want to take a couple more pictures outside and then we have to run errands. But definitely stop by Smokehouse. Five and a half burps. Out of five. Definitely. I think it's better than it used to be. I've never been right here before, but this is really good. I think we will be returning to Smokehouse to do continued reviews in the future because they have a 
pretty good sized menu Definitely. and we basically had One two sandwiches. Oh, you didn't even get to try mine. I'm sorry. I almost lied. I ate all mine after I took well, a bite of yours. Well, I did take. I took a bite of your beef. Okay.